Bloomington, Indiana is a college town with a lot of brain power. In fact, brains have begun popping up everywhere. This brain extravaganza is the brainchild of this woman. Jill Bolte Taylor is an Indiana University brain scientist who survived a stroke and spent nearly a decade putting her life back together. But why brains on street corners? Cows have been on display in over a hundred cities around the world. Cows. Brains. Why not brains? Appreciation, awareness, education. We have 22 brains this size created. Uh, they're going to be all over town and nine on campus. Depending on the sponsor or what the, the uh, sponsor wanted to communicate, every brain is going to be very unique. There's an important educational component to this brain extravaganza, including a phone app. Every brain will have a sign attached to the base. It'll have the name of the sponsor, the name of the artist, five facts about the brain, and then a question, which is specific to your brain. And so depending on what your answer is, it will paint your brain a certain color. And then you can upload your brain on Facebook and share it with your friends, and people are talking brains. You know, as I think about what makes a healthy brain, it's a lot of neural connections between the cells making up that brain. The exact same thing is for a healthy community, but on the macrocosm. So with this project, we have worked with the city, we've worked with IU, we've worked with the artist community, the business community, the volunteer community, and everybody is networking in a really positive way. The brain extravaganza will remain on display all summer. I'm Mike Pfeiffer reporting from Bloomington, Indiana.